Hello everybody! This is our last week of our Philippians series, so we'll be done with these videos after this week. And we're talking about joy in the big picture. So last Sunday we heard Pastor Jeff talk about joy in the big picture. And then we talked with Miss Angie and the whole Walston clan about the big picture and the final days. Do you remember what we talked about with Miss Angie? We talked through this. Do you remember what these mean? So manger, Jesus was born in a manger. Cross, he died on the cross, but did he stay dead? No, he rose again and is king of kings. So you have the cool crown on top of your head and Jesus is king of kings and he will be the king forever. And we talked about heaven and how heaven is more beautiful than the most beautiful thing you've ever seen. And so we get to look forward to that in the final days. I wanted to talk a little bit more about Jesus. So if you have your Read and Share Bible, you can open up to the last story um, on page 418, and I'm going to read through it, and then you guys can follow along at home, okay? New Heaven and Earth. One of the biggest promises God ever made was that he, we will live with Him in heaven forever. He said that there would be a new heaven and a new earth, and we would get a new body, one that won't get old, but we will live forever. In the new heaven, no one will ever be sad again. No one will ever die again. The streets will be made of gold, and there will be gates of pearl. Everything will be more beautiful than anything you can imagine. And best of all, Jesus will be there. We will be with him forever. I really like the way that ends. The best thing of all is that we will be with Jesus. So Jesus is kind of like our best friend. Have you ever had a best friend? Maybe this best friend is someone in your class or in your age group, or maybe it's even your parents or your siblings, and this best friend knows everything there is to about, about you. They know your favorite foods, your favorite outfits or toys, and they know everything you like, but they also know everything you don't like. They know everything there is to about you, which is very cool, and that's a great thing to have in a best friend. But Jesus is even better. Jesus is our best friend who knows everything about us, even things that we don't really know about us. And he is our best friend, but he will love us forever no matter what. And he already has promised that through coming as a baby and dying on a cross and rising again, he has shown us just how much he loves us. But he doesn't want to just die on the cross and not be with us anymore. He wants to be with us forever, and that is the hope that we have when we look forward to the final days, and we look forward to Jesus coming again, and we get to be with him forever. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your week, and have a great summer.